morning, boys and girls. I uh, hope that y'all are doing great this morning. We are celebrating um, Dr. Seuss's birthday, which is March the 2nd. And so it's Read Across America, and we're celebrating um, reading because he wrote many great books. And one of those great books is Green Eggs and Ham. And I chose this book to read because it was one of my favorite books when I was a child. And in fact, I would make my dad read this book to me over and over and over again because I loved it so much. So I thought that I would share this book with you guys and read it to you because it's one of my favorites. So it is Green Eggs and Ham by Dr. Seuss. I am Sam. Sam, I am. That Sam I am, that Sam I am, I do not like that Sam I am. You can tell by the look on his face, he's grumpy. Do you like green eggs and ham? I do not like them, Sam I am. I do not like green eggs and ham. Would you like them here or there? I would not like them here or there. I would not like them anywhere. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Would you like them in a house? Would you like them with a mouse? I do not like them in a house. I do not like them with a mouse. I do not like them here or there. I do not like them anywhere. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Hmm, would you eat them in a box? Would you eat them with a fox? Not in a box, not with a fox, not in a house, not with a mouse. I would not eat them here or there. I would not eat them anywhere. I would not eat green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. Would you, could you in a car? Eat them, eat them, here they are. I would not, could not, in a car. You may like them. You will see. You may like them in a tree. I would not, could not, in a tree. Not in a car. You let me be. I do not like them in a box. I do not like them with a fox. I do not like them in a house. I do not like them with a mouse. I do not like them here or there. I do not like them anywhere. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. A train, a train, a train. Could you, would you on a train? Not on a train, not in a tree, not in a car. Sam, let me be. I would not, could not in a box. I could not, would not with a fox. I will not eat them with a mouse. I will not eat them in a house. I will not eat them here or there. I will not eat them anywhere. I do not eat green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. I think he's getting really irritated at this point because he's standing there and he's waving his finger. My mom used to do that when she was really aggravated with me when I was a kid. There's her finger. Say, in the dark, here in the dark. Would you, could you, in the dark? I would not, could not, in the dark. Would you, could you, in the rain? I would not, could not, in the rain. Not in the dark, 
not on a train, not in a car, not in a tree. I do not like them, Sam, you see. Not in a house, not in a box, not with a mouse, not with a fox. I will not eat them here or there. I will not eat them anywhere. Do you not like their eggs and ham? I do not like them, Sam, I am. Could you, would you, with a goat? I would not, could not, with a goat. Would you, could you, on a boat? I could not, would not, on a boat. I could not, would not, with a goat. I will not eat them in the rain. I will not eat them on a train. Not in the dark, not in a tree, not in a car. You let me be. I will not like them in a box. I do not like them with a fox. I will not eat them in a house. I do not like them with a mouse. I do not like them here or there. I do not like them anywhere. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. You do not like them, so you say. Fry them, try them, and you may. Try them, and you may, I say. Sam, if you will let me be, I will try them. You will see. So I think he's finally worn him down. He's aggravated him to death. Just aggravated him so much that he says, oh my gosh, if you if I try them, will you leave me alone? That's how he feels right now. He's like, oh my gosh. You will I'll I'll take a bite if you just leave me alone. And look, he really looks like he does not want to take a bite. Look at his face. His face is like, I really don't want to eat this. But if he will leave me alone, I'll take one bite. And everybody else is looking like, is he going to like it? Is he going to like it? Oh my goodness, what's going to happen? And what do you think? His face tells you everything, right? You don't even have to start reading the words. His face tells you what he liked it. Say, I like green eggs and ham. I do. I like them, Sam I am. And I would eat them in a boat. And I would eat them with a goat. <laughs> and I will eat them in the rain. And in the dark. And on the train. And in a car. And in a tree. They are so, so good, you see. I will eat them in a box, and I will eat them with a fox, and I will eat them in a house, and I will eat them with a mouse, and I will eat them here, and I will eat them there, and I will eat them anywhere. I do so like green eggs and ham. Thank you, thank you, Sam I am. And that's the end. So at first he decided he was so set against green eggs and ham because he did not think that he was going to like it. He was, no, I'm not eating it. No, no, no. It, no, I'm not eating it at all. I'm not going to take a bite. Mm -mm, you cannot get me to eat it at all. And then finally, after Sam I Am aggravated him so much, just aggravated, aggravated, aggravated him, he said, okay, I'll take one bite if you will leave me alone. And so he took one bite and he decided, oh my gosh, I love it. It's the best thing ever. So that kind of gives you a little lesson that maybe it might not look like something you would like to eat or you may think, mm -mm, I don't like it because somebody told me that they didn't like it. 
But if you try it, it might be the best thing ever and you might love it. So um, maybe it's worth giving some something a try just to taste it. You might love it. You might not love it, but it might be something new that you really like. So maybe you could learn something from this book that you give something a try. Um, but again, this was my favorite book when I was a little kid because, oh, I just loved it. I, and I could listen to it over and over and over and over again when I was a kid. So, Green Eggs and Ham, guys, Dr. Seuss.